Calculating. And orbit stabilizing. Right to Earth. My people have killed for this. But I will offer you one chance to hand over the artifact and turn away from this path. That's not any type of ship I recognize. Uh... You tell us more about who you are. save anyway surrender the artifact or jump if we surrender it at least we can find them later right and take it back oh I really got so much After we go to the uh watch found outpost. Mm, interesting. Absolutely. We have much to discuss. City, isn't it? There's nowhere else like it in the galaxy. Well, that's how we spends a fortune to maintain the lodge, but I'd say it's worth every credit. Hmm. 
How is Neon? Are you? Are you okay? Are you look. I need you to look into the data on my ship, then. Okay. I'll start transferring the data over now. Let me just bring it up on here at the table. The table? Is that... Is that a prototype? No, that material isn't anything we... What the... Everyone, come take a look at this. That's no faction vessel or crimson fleet. Secret military tech, maybe? Hmm, no United Colonies Admiral approved that starship design. They call themselves the Star Lord. Demanding we hand over the artifact. Like we were children, playing with their parents' things. What do people know? Any offshoot groups go by that name? None in any corner of the settled systems I've seen. Maybe a distant human colony, finally popping its head up? <sighs> Another house for room? I very much doubt that. We ignoring the obvious here? A heretofore unknown group who just happens to know about the artifacts. I'm just gonna say it. Intelligent alien life, or extra-dimensional beings. The original creators from the furthest fringes of space. Or beyond even that. Is the metaphor of avenging angels coming down to keep humanity from forbidden knowledge not apt here? So, we have a lot of theories, but nothing concrete. Except that they're after the artifacts, and they're willing to take them by force. I understand the starship designs could be easily human. To Barrett's point, artifacts clearly aren't human. The Tay's metaphor has merit, I'd like they were doing out. Barrett's point, the artifacts clearly aren't human. No settled systems lab made these things, and I doubt one of them made that ship either. So we got some weird extra-dimensional beings that coincidentally decide to build their spacefaring vessels exactly like we do. I'm not so sure about that. Noel, start analyzing all the data from the ship sensors, the I gravitational wave they caused, beings. scans of their I weapons, shields, disgusting. everything. We're in the dark. We need to learn anything about them we can including some way to fight them, if necessary. Until then, we stay the course. Collect the artifacts. It's even more important now that an intelligence we don't know or understand is looking for them. Agreed. The only way we learn is more is to keep going. All we can do is be more cautious, but we are not stopping. This could end up being a race we don't want to lose. Vladimir, has the eye picked up anything new? Some glints of shine in the dark. Ready to hand them out as soon as you please. All right. Good luck, everyone. And be careful out there. Interesting. We've done that. Too many squads. You had a hell of a shake getting bullied in the void. Starborn sure know how to make an entrance. Ready to head back out there? The eye can help you find the artifacts, but I'm afraid she's blind to our new competitor. Um, I'm ready. Double check the safety and locks wherever you go, okay? Exploration's dangerous, even without some nefarious group trying to kill you. He is correct. I need a cup of tea. I return to the lodge. Triggered a full system update. I am... This guy. Samuel with us? Alright. 
Yeah, I'm gonna be right back. I'm gonna go get some food. Oh, we need to make sure we do still get our surveys done though. Oh, we need to find something. Uh... We'll quickly check out this out. I think it might actually be what we need. Hello! Get out, we are back. You didn't get her. Had myself some sausage rolls, watching the bit of co carnage and some water. I did like that video. You sent me yeah, the one with the guy who had all the potatoes. Yeah, that's funny. We now need to go that way. Oh, we leveled up. There's quite a few of these that we got. I think the persuasion skill is going to be so powerful. I haven't got anything into this stuff. I'm an engineer and we could do it. We'll leave it for now. I think persuasion might be the best bet, but... Yeah, there is. Nothing ever despawns from what, uh, from what I've been seeing. You can play stuff anywhere in the game. Come back to a later station and still be there. It'd be kind of cool if, like, your outpost to get ready, though. I think that'd be kind of cool. Man, I don't know what it is about this stuff, but like nighttime on these planets, on the on the, like moons and stuff, no clouds, no nothing, cause there's no water in the atmosphere.
Find it. I've upgraded the accuracy of this gun, by the way. I think I might actually set it for lower as well. I gained one quantum instant. They're definitely humanoid. Yeah, I agree. The uh, the objects that you can place and stuff. Wow, look at that star! It's really. This is only ninety eight percent explored. You can angle where to look. Can't oh, fast travel. Oh, you can't fast travel what's inside of a uh, level loaded instant. Cool. Annoying. Cool. Oh, there's definitely some parkour going on here. Hey. You just wanted me to go over here, game. <laughs> Collecting the universe map, that's what you're thinking. I got no idea, mate. It's definitely three rings, which means I think that it's actually like Stargate. Where because you got the we had the rings from before, right? Um I I, I think it's just teleportation. Okay. That's what I think. But I got no idea. We shall see. And I am definitely making this gun for the way. 